welcome to Dunia Camp. Uh, the place is run entirely by women, and uh, most seem to have a child back in Arusha, looked after by their parents or grandparents. Some even have a man lurking about back there. One of our guides said uh, many a marriage is saved by their working apart. As you can see, this is a very different setup to the one that we had on the walking tour. This is glamping. Domestic ones. Oh, okay. So tasty. So tasty. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> They're so tasty. Now I wish I could give a commentary worthy of a David Attenborough, but I can't. I can point out the zebras and uh, the old giraffe, etc., but I can't actually tell you anything interesting about them. So you'll just have to look and wonder. I wonder how these animals spend their days without recourse to inventing TV.
while we leave the lions there to light up a cigarette and contemplate whether they've let their passions get the better of them, uh, I'll tell you something about these little fellas, the Hyrax. These creatures apparently are their nearest relatives to the elephant. I can't say whether it's by marriage or parentage, but I understand they have uh, four knees or something, uh, and, and a long gestation period, and a remarkably good long-term memory, though I can't think how anybody discovered that, but maybe they're good at cards. <laughs> Another day in the Serengeti ends and we rush back to a well-earned gin and tonic. And I hope you'll join us uh, on the next day. And uh, oh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Oh